May 1st, Monday, 10 a.m. Mountain Time, 2017. Earthquake swarm up here in the northern British Columbia, Alaska area, right up here in the far northwestern corner of Canada. It's considered Alaska, uh, technically, but you can see right here there's been a swarm of earthquakes just in the last few hours, and the majority of them are surface quakes. Look at this, zero, 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 right on the surface. Some have some depth, but for the most part, they are all surface earthquakes. So you naturally ask yourself, okay, what's going on here? Is this a volcano? No, I've actually looked. Even looked for traces of uh, sulfur in the atmosphere. None from this area. So it's not an earthquake. So what is it? You want to know what it is? You want to know the truth? About three weeks ago, it was documented that a river has just changed direction in this area right here. Started running backwards right where the earthquakes are at. Goes on to say why. It's something that's never really been witnessed in modern times until now. A glacier has melted changing the topography of the area and it caused the river to run a different direction. Well in the meantime that glacier has continued to melt and this is something that I've studied years ago and that's why I, I, I mentioned with all of the water weight transfer um, in California back in February possibly triggering earthquakes. This is exactly what I meant. It's, a, uh, it's not a phenomenon, it's a reality. It's called isostatic rebound. And that's what's going on right here. You're witnessing it. This is something that is uh, quite rare. You're witnessing an earthquake outbreak due to a glacier melt that is releasing the land underneath it, the heavy, tremendous weight of the water. It just happened to be in frozen form, a solid form, not a liquid. But still, that weight is transferring around now because the, the glacier is melting. And it just moved just enough to trigger an earthquake outbreak right there in that area. So that's what's really going on. It's not a volcano. Doesn't have anything to do with the Cascadia, at least just yet. It's called post-glacial rebound. What it is, is the rise of land masses that were depressed by the huge weight of ice sheets during the last glacial period through a process known as isostatic dep depression. Isostatic rebound means the ground is moving back up. And that's why we're seeing so many surface quakes in this area. Simply a glacier melt. This is exactly where the river ran backwards last month. So you're witnessing something quite remarkable right there. History in the making. Isostatic rebound. During these uncertain times, I encourage you to be brave, be strong, be wise, and be ready. Thanks for watching.